Welcome back for another one. You excited, Corjo? She's real excited. We took the boat and uh, we're gonna hop in this marsh here. I got the Invisiman, got the uh, decoy sled loaded down with some decoys. So we're going out for a little afternoon sit in a spot that I think might produce some birds, but who knows? I saw probably 10 mallards and three wood ducks when I was driving in here. So definitely a good sign knowing that I'm close to being in the right spot. But we're gonna get to walk in here, set up, and I'll catch up with you guys then. All right, buddy. You ready to go? You got your Invisilab there. Got my Invisiman set up here. We got the old motion ducks out today. We got some wind. We got the motion ducks out there. Look at this. Look at those decoys move. Oh yeah, that's gonna be the ticket right there. So yeah, running a little small spread today. I think maybe 18, 19 decoys or so. So not too many. Three pulsators, got the motion ducks. We're ready to rock. So we're gonna get settled in here and hopefully see some ducks flying. I got I got a good feeling about this. First duck of the season. Go get it. Come on, buddy. Up, up, back. No. Back. Good. Keep going. Keep going, buddy. There you go. There you go. Good girl. Good girl. Here, good girl, good girl. Good job, good girl. Look at that little brown dog. This is a proud moment. This is such a proud moment. Good girl, here. Good. Fetch. Good. Come on. Good. Good. Hey, fetch. Here. Drop. Pintail, baby. Dude, your first big duck was a pintail. Nice job, good girl. Nice. Nice. First duck of the season is a freaking pintail. Cora, here. Nice job, dude. I am so stoked and happy and proud of this little dog. Pintail is her first big duck. Golly. I could pack up and go home right now and be a happy guy. First duck of the season. First real retrieve that went through. We definitely need to keep working on her recall coming all the way back, but we're polishing things up. Her hold was good. I mean, everything looked great. I'm so happy. And it's not even close to being shooting light yet. And we got our pintail for the day. So we're gonna keep sticking it out here and hopefully see some more ducks.
no bird. Sit. Son of a gun. I don't know what the heck my deal is. Shooting is bad. I think it's, I'm excited. I haven't really had a good duck hunt yet this year, so that's one thing. I mean, I've had quite a few birds working right in front of me. I'm either pulling up too, I think I'm put, just pulling up too late, and I think I might not be used to sitting like in this blind and shooting out of it, so. I think there's definitely a bit of a learning curve. Hey, hush. I don't know. I really don't know. I nailed that pintail right off the bat and then everything else had just been poop. So, I don't know. I think I'll be more likely to take some faster shots and uh, get those ducks that are right in front of me, right when they are, and not worry about them finishing super hard into the decoys because it doesn't really look like any ducks are doing that right now. We'll just take the shots we can get. I should have taken the mallard and it looked like a spoonie right at the right when they pass right in front of me and chip shot. I don't know, <laughs> I was just like in awe looking like, uh, what's actually happening right now? I'm sure we'll see some more groups coming through and we'll tighten up the shooting and be a little more proactive about it and shoot some more ducks. What the heck is going on? Sit. Long one. She'll get it. There you go. There you go. Good dog. Good. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl, good girl. Good. Good. Here. Good. Good. Drop. Good. Redhead, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Good dog, good girl. Good girl. Yes. Stud drink redhead. Place. Good girl. Good dog. Alrighty guys. Drake redhead. Take a look at that. Look at those colors on that thing. It looks good. That was Cora's longest retrieve she's ever done. Good job, buddy. You're showing all the haters what it's all about. You're doing good. We've been doing some uh, kind of mock hunt setups and getting her used to all the excitement that happens on a hunt. So it's good to see that that's really paying off right here. She's been steady, 
she's been marking well she's doing everything great so i'm i'm stoked but that's two Let's see if we can get some more i honestly i should have at least four or five right now but the shooting's been tough but it's okay we got probably a little less than an hour left of sunlight left so we'll keep at it here and hopefully get a couple more <laughs> That's pretty cool. I've actually never seen geese in a marsh, let alone come that close to this breath. I'm no way I'm shooting the goose. It'd be cool for Cora to get a goose, but yeah, I'm shooting fours. And I don't want to lug that stupid thing out. Well, that is a wrap for today's hunt. You are a rock star. You did really good. I'm super proud of my dog today. She has really shown some real potential. And I'm just more and more excited to get her out. End of the day, they drake redhead and a hen pintail. So, not lights out. My shooting was horrible. Um, I feel like I, uh, I really botched it. I could have shot a lot more birds so my shooting was better. So hopefully I can get in the groove of it. I think, you know, dealing with her and hunting out of this for the first time, that kind of combo made for a little bit of a stressful shooting situation. So, hey, I, I feel like I was pulling my head up thinking I hit the duck and looking, waiting for it to hit the water so then I can send her. So, you know, little things along the way, but all in all, she did good. I could have done a lot better, but that's just kind of how it goes. I'm going to get these decoys picked up real quick and get out of here.